What is the difference between commercial and residential structures? Commercial and residential make up the vast majority of real estate, leaving behind only the industrial aspect. Now, general public interacts with both commercial and residential structures. There are differences in both the categories because of the intent and purpose that each is made for. Thus, the commercial and residential structures vary considerably. Some of the differences are mentioned below. Purpose Commercial buildings are more complex when compared to the residential ones. This has to do with their functions. The commercial structures need to withstand higher loads of owing to the large amount of people inhabiting or visiting the structure, whereas residential structures are made to cater a limited amount of people. Commercial spaces are more costly compared to residential ones, but then again, it has to do with the purpose of the structures. Since commercial spaces are put to the use of earning money, it makes sense for them to be more costly, whereas residential buildings are meant for end use. The laws, standards which are applicable for commercial constructions are more stringent. Supporting Infrastructure Requirement Commercial structures need to have more supportive infrastructure when compared to residential. Again, this is connected to the large loads that commercial structures are made to handle. All the commercial buildings need to universally accessible. The accessibility should be individual, meaning the building should be accessible to all, irrespective of age, gender, etc. There would be the need of elevators that will accommodate sufficient amount of people, bathrooms which are easily accessible, even canteens. All of these are not that necessary for residential sector. Also, commercial buildings needs to be in the commercial zone. In marketplace, scale. The scale of the residential project when compared to commercial is quite small. This is because the requirements are less. Therefore, the residential buildings would be lesser in terms of the materials required, even the labor and machinery requirements. On the other hand, the commercial buildings are bigger than residential buildings and would be generally divided into different units. The size of the building to the design of the building will be quite different and commercial construction would be more complex as was discussed. HVAC, mechanical, plumbing and electrical work. The electrical, plumbing and HVAC system in commercial buildings are more complicated than residential buildings. This is because of the size of the building and its functionality and the more load being incurred than in the residential sector, the plumbing requirement and the number of washroom being provided in the commercial space would depend on the number of people that are expected to occupy the building. The HVAC design is more complex, though it is centralized. Finishes The finished in the commercial architecture design are very different from residential. The focus is more on the aesthetic and functionality in commercial, which although could be equally important factor for residential. Also, the main motive in commercial building is to attract the customer or improve productivity of workers. Thus, the facade, the lighting, the floor layout should create an ambience, which would attract potential buyers or create an atmosphere of increased productivity. Whereas in residential, the focus is on providing a relaxing and calm place for an individual to make it their heaven. These are the major differences in commercial and residential structure.